Are you a dinosaur yet? Subscribe to become one now. Hello all dinosaurs, I'm Dan and welcome back to a brand new video and today we will be taking a look at 25 amazing dinosaurs, animals and sea animals. So let's get started, okay? Let's begin with a dinosaur first and I hope that you guys are staying safe and well at home, okay? During this very difficult time, okay? So sit back, relax, and enjoy this video together with your family. First, let's take a look at this amazing dinosaur. This is actually from the Jurassic World collection. Let's take a look at this. And this is an Allosaurus. Yep, that's right. An Allosaurus. It's a carnivore. A theropod. Let's check this out. So right here, we have an Allosaurus, you can actually move the jaw, the legs, and the tail. This is brilliant. I'm gonna place all the different dinosaurs over here. Sea animals will be right in the middle, and the animals on the right side, okay? So let's carry on with a sea animal, okay? Let's take a look at this, Nile. Crocodile. Alright, let's take a look at this. This is one of the animals with the largest bite force, which means the bite is the strongest. Yep, it is definitely one of the most amazing creatures out there. Nile Crocodile, and it definitely looks like one of the prehistoric animals. What type of dinosaur does this Nile crocodile reminds you of? Any idea? How about Sakosuchus? Yep, that's right. Okay, next up, another very, very amazing creature which you can find in your zoo probably. Cheetah, the fastest land animal. Let's take a look. That's right. If you take a look at a cheetah, it is actually much smaller than a tiger or a lion, but it is super fast. You can take a look at the slender legs and the slender body. It's very, very aerodynamic, which means which provides it with um, speed, um, agility, and grace. Okay, let's take a look at another dinosaur. Of course, we have this beautiful, beautiful Nasudoceratops right here, also from the Jurassic World series. Let's take a look at this. Nasudoceratops, it's a ceratopsian. Which dinosaur does this remind you of? You know, one very, very famous dinosaur. What is it? Triceratops! Yes, that's right. But it only has two horns. It's compared to the Triceratops. Triceratops has three horns. Let's take a look at this. Beautiful. You can actually move the head and the tail. And these two dinosaurs, they are both from the battle um, at the Big Rock series. Okay. Let's take a look at my one of my most favorite sea animals. Oops. Let's place all the different boxes back. We have a great white shark right here. Great white shark. Really, really ferocious looking. And this has a great sense of smell. Alright. Let's take a look at this. Beautiful shark. Alright. Let's place this right in the middle. And let's take a look at our next um, animal. We have a rhinoceros, and this is my most favorite animal. It looks like a prehistoric um, dinosaur to me. Yes, rhinoceros, I love it. They look so, so, so beautiful. I love, you know, how it looks. I love how, how it behaves. Really beautiful. Rhinoceros, they are, you know, endangered. 
because many people are actually hunting them for their horns because um yeah some of them actually believe the horns have some medicinal purposes which i'm not too sure i don't think so you shouldn't buy rhinoceros products okay let's try to save them let's take a look at our next dinosaur we have a hybrid dinosaur right here indoraptor oh my goodness what is the ankylosaurus doing here i have no idea and what about this what is oh my goodness and oh dear the indoraptor is not here but that's fine let's take a look at this what is this are you guys able to tell me what is this this is the ankylosaurus it is known as the fused lizard because the bones inside are all fused together to form a very very strong armor next up let's take a look at this a beautiful dolphin and this is actually known as the pacific white sided dolphin yep that's right wow looks beautiful Dolphins, they are very, very, very intelligent um, animals. Are you able to move the jaw right here? Let's try it. Yep, that's right. You can move it. The tail can be moved as well. Let's place the sea animal right in the middle. And let me just adjust the camera so that we have more of the space right here. Next up, let's take a look at this polar bear. Yeah polar bear another very very amazing animal you know why um you know this animal it actually has fur which are transparent but they look like they are white but they are actually transparent yeah transparent fur how amazing is that okay this place is right over here let's take a look at not a dinosaur okay this is definitely not blue and pteranodon of course blue and pteranodon is actually over here so we're gonna switch okay we're gonna take a look at more dinosaurs let's see what's inside we have the indoraptor here so they're all mixed up so we have more dinosaurs indoraptor is a hybrid dinosaur it contains the DNA of the Indominus Rex and Blue. And this is Baby Blue right over here. And just take a look at how adorable it looks. And we have a baby Pteranodon, is it? Or is it just a Pteranodon? I think it is just a Pteranodon. Cool. Very, very cool. Alright, let's take a look at another sea animal. We have the Killer wheel, or also known as um, the old car. Yep, that's right. For a minute, I couldn't remember what is its name. <laughs> All right, the old car is actually a type of dolphin as well. Very, very intelligent dolphin. I'm just gonna place it right over here, and let's take a look at one of the largest, or in fact. The largest land animal. Let's take a look. The elephant. Right. The elephant has a pretty amazing ability. They can actually sense the trembles of the ground on the ground to determine, you know, you know whether the predator is coming, whether other animals are coming. They're very, very smart and intelligent. Next, let's take a look at um, another dinosaur, shall we? Oh, let's take a look at this. The Spinosaurus. Let's take a look. Spinosaurus is known as the Spine Lizard because of its huge and tall neural spines. These are called neural spines. Neural spine bones. Spinosaurus, the Spine Lizard. It's actually bigger than a T-Rex. You guys do not know yep that's right next up let's take a look at this very very amazing creature which is able to do echolocation to 
find its way in the water. Yeah, it can actually emit um, some echolocation from over here. This part of this head. Using the echolocation, I mean. Yep, the striped beluga whale. It looks so, so, so adorable. Next up, another, not a powerful animal. Gorilla. Gorilla. Striped. Let's take a look at this. So cute, so adorable. I'll place this right over here. Let's take a look at Mosasaurus. Not exactly a dinosaur, but it is a prehistoric sea creature. That's right. Mosasaurus. Just take a look at how beautiful this figure looks. I'm just gonna place this right over here. We are running out of space. If you take a look at this, let's go full speed ahead. We have the largest, largest um, animal, the blue whale. It comes with an adult and a calf. Yep, the baby of a blue whale is known as a calf. Next up, the animal with um, to my knowledge, the animal with the largest bite force. That's right, it belongs to the saltwater crocodile. How amazing is this? Let's do a comparison. Both looking very different, especially in terms of the colors. Okay, and now for my most favorite dinosaur of all time. Tyrannosaurus Rex. Tyrannosaurus Rex, yes, it is my most favorite dinosaur. You guys know? Yep. Now you know. T Rex is my most favorite dinosaur. When I was younger, I loved the T Rex. I love it since young. I think it is because of Jurassic Park. Will Shock. Will Shock. You know, the name seems to be very very scary and dangerous but it is actually a very very docile sea animal I went to Philippines Cebu a um, couple of years back and I actually swam with um, some of them and they were very very nice very nice and amazing I love them next up let's take a look tiger right here just going full speed ahead. Another beautiful, beautiful big cat. That's right, a tiger is a big cat. Hippopotamus. What is the giraffe doing inside the hippopotamus? This is amazing. I've got that all mixed up. All mixed up. But this is the tallest land animal. That's right. That's right. Okay, let's take a look at this. This is this should be a bear inside. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Finally, yeah, a brown bear. Beautiful bear. I love bears. They look so adorable, but they are in fact quite dangerous. Yeah, if you provoke them, right? Indominus Rex, another super dangerous, perhaps one of the most dangerous dinosaur. It. Spares no animals or human beings. Very aggressive, very ferocious. And our last dinosaur of the day. Sticky Moloch. Alright. Yes, that's right. So these are our 25 different dinosaurs, animals, and sea animals. Which one is your most favorite? Let me know over on Instagram. For me, my most favorite figure, most favorite figure, top three, T-Rex, um, Indominus Rex, 
and probably the great white shark what about you guys so let me know over on instagram okay yep so that's right here's the end of the video hope that you guys enjoy it and if you did please give it a thumbs up share it drop i can't say drop me a comment because we no longer have the commenting function so let me know over on, over on instagram and i'll see you soon probably tomorrow or wednesday for the next video okay goodbye